So, Admiral, with that in mind, from what I'm hearing, it sounds like the, the piece here where you can move things around and perhaps get the lower price is the number of VLS cells. And my understanding is the Navy's looking at between 16 and 32. So being a, a simpleton, just look to me, you just strike down the middle and 24 VLS cells seems to be about the right number. Do you have any comment on that? Uh, yes, sir. The, well, I want as many as I can get. Um, I mean, the well, Remember, we have to take into take account cost. Yes, sir. Uh, so, um, you know, and the requirements RFP, uh, lethality is a piece of that. It's, gonna, it's a cost, it's lethality, uh, and all those will compete to the, to the final selection. But do you have any thoughts about what the right number of BLS cells it would be? Uh, the right number is 32 or more, um, but we'll, uh, we're willing to have, have that as part of the trade space when we make the final, final selection. And when you, when you compare a frigate to a destroyer, which has over 100 cells, you can see the, you know, the mismatch we're trying to uh, balance here as we balance distributed lethality and mass lethality. And we have to bring both to the fight. And this is very fundamental to an away game Navy that we pretty much bring what we have. So how you bring it and how you distribute it is very much as important to uh, lethality per ship.